America's next top models Tyra Banks has built a hugely fruitful career hosting and producing the model search reality show, which has produced in over 30 countries including the UK. Peter Crouch's wife, Abby Clancy presents the British version. Having come second in the first series. Tyra also has released music as well as had a turn at acting appearing at Feel Good Film. Coyote Ugly and the Fresh Prince of Bel Air as Will Smith's love interest. But undoubtedly, Tyra's biggest claim to fame is her hugely successful modeling career. Seeing her walk for fashion houses such as Dior, Calvin Klein, and Dolce and Gabbana. The 44-year-old who also presents America's Got Talent has become famed for her good looks. Sent shockwaves across the globe when she admitted that she'd had a little bit of help from the surgeon. Revealing she'd had a nose job before her modeling days. She said, I had bones in my nose that were growing and itching. I could breathe fine. But I added cosmetic surgery. I admit it fake hair, and I did my nose. I feel I have a responsibility to tell truth, she told people. She added fix it or flaunt it, I think women should be able to do both. There is a boundary line. Either you're supernatural or you live at the plastic surgeon. It's okay to hop back and forth over the line. You want a hair weave? Fine. You want permanent eyebrows? Fine. We as women need to stop judging. The supermodel extraordinaire admitted that she has been plagued with plastic surgery rumors throughout her successful career. It was a very big rumor that I had breast implants and I don't blame you. On the cover of these magazines, I was very young. I was 23, 24, 25 and they were up there like bam and they pretty much looked fake she told piers morgan during a cnn interview in 2011 tyra also said to the publication that she will never judge people for what they choose to have done to themselves surgery wise natural beauty is unfair I get really uncomfortable when women who are these natural beauties judge anybody who does anything to themselves, 